Hello guys, what is up? It is Cameron coming back to you guys today with a new review and today we're going to be reviewing a budget mechanical keyboard that comes to us from SteelSeries and it's their new Apex M500. Now this keyboard comes in at $99 which is pretty reasonably priced compared to all the other mechanical LED backlit keyboards that are on the market nowadays. I mean the Apex M800 is $199 so this is $100 cheaper and it really offers a budget option to people that do want to purchase a mechanical keyboard that does have LED backlighting. So if you want to check this out, visit the link in the description down below to their website. You can check out this keyboard as well as all their other keyboards they have to offer that we've reviewed in the past. So check down there for more information and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into the review and I'll tell you if this keyboard is worth your money. Alright, so let's start off the video by talking about what you get in the box. When you first actually receive this keyboard, the only two things you're going to get with it are going to be a quick start guide slash user's manual and then you're also going to get two different stickers. You get a black and a white one and these are the only two things that actually come in the box. Now the keyboard itself is a full size keyboard which means that it does offer the number pad on the right side. It is a little bit more compact than their other keyboards like the Apex M800 which is much larger um, but it does have some macro keys on it so that's what makes it bigger. I'm personally more of a fan of this smaller compact size keyboard. It doesn't take up as much room on my desk but it still gives me the ability to do anything I want to like I'm able to game and type and stuff with no issues whatsoever. Um, and I just overall like the smaller size. Now this keyboard does feature Cherry MX Red switches which are in my opinion the best switches for keyboards just because they offer great response times and they're not as loud as the Cherry MX Blue switches which are just kind of obnoxious in my opinion. Um, now along with this it does offer full anti-ghosting and end key rollover and what this means is that whenever you press a key you're going to get the fastest response time possible um so when you're playing games you don't want to have to slam your finger down on the key for it to react in game you want to just press the key normally and it automatically react to whatever you just did in the game and this keyboard offers you know a competitive experience with a full end key rollover and full anti-ghosting um now the red switches are amazing because whenever you're typing and stuff you get that nice tactile response that you would you know with the mechanical keys but like I said it's not as loud as Cherry MX Blue switches which are just a little bit too loud in my opinion. In addition to having excellent keys this also does feature excellent build quality. Right when I took it out of the box I could immediately tell that it does feature a robust design and it did have some weight to it which kind of signaled to me that it wasn't you know cheaply made or using cheap plastic. It actually features very durable and thick plastic so I, I really feel like I'll never have to worry about this keyboard falling on the ground and getting injured or anything like that um, just immediately you can tell that it is a high quality well put together keyboard especially for $99 I almost feel like it's more well made and has better uh, like actual material in it than some of the other more expensive keyboards that I've reviewed in the past so it may be pretty straightforward and not feature all these like fancy lights or screens on it um, but it does feature a sleek and minimalistic design um, and that combined with the build quality is honestly something I look forward to more than you know all these random bells and whistles that you may never Ever use on your keyboard you know it just works and it works very well and that's what you want in a gaming keyboard something that you know is going to be reliable not break on you and function perfectly in game and that's what you have right here the LED lights on this keyboard are pretty simple you're only going to get an option to have blue uh, lights but really if you're not a huge fan of RGB and all these rainbow colors this might not be a big problem to you I personally think it looks nice I really like the blue lights on it they shine really bright at night uh, but you do have the option directly on the keyboard to dim them as bright or as you know not bright as you want it to be all you have to do is hold down the steel series key and then you have some hotkeys at the top under the f5 and the f6 key and you can just dim it to as bright or as not bright as you want it to be now one of the coolest aspects of this keyboard doesn't even reside on the top of the keyboard it actually is underneath and that is steel series cable management solution now this cable management solution is really great because it allows you to have three different routes for the wire on this keyboard you can run it to the right side the middle or the left side and it really is perfect because in my situation my computer monitor is right in front of this keyboard and I want to reroute it to the left side so all I have to do is pick the wire up and just you know push it around that route and voila it's on the left side and it's out of my way and it isn't annoying like if it's in the middle um, so some keyboards don't give you this option and it's kind of one of those small things that you never really think about but when you have it you just you know don't want to not use it you know what I mean so they really uh, came in the clutch with this one I think it's a really great idea and it's 
it's one of my favorite parts of this keyboard. So really and truly the Apex M500 is pretty straightforward in what it has to offer and that's quality and performance in a no nonsense fashion. So it's very direct about what it has to offer and it does it very well. Honestly this is my favorite keyboard under $100 that I've ever used. There is some other ones that I do like but they are a bit more pricey. So really if you just want bare bones, high performance quality keyboard, this is definitely the best option in my opinion if you're looking to spend under $100. Thanks so much for checking out my review. If you are interested in purchasing the SteelSeries M500, visit the link in the description down below. You can check out their website and other other products. I want to thank you for checking out my video. If you did enjoy it, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more content. I upload reviews and unboxing of mainly tech products, but also some other stuff. Also, leave a like rating if you did enjoy the video, and also leave in the comment section down below if there's anything I can improve on. But thanks for watching, guys. Hope you did enjoy, and I'll catch you in my next video. See ya.